Hi and welcome to the session. Let us discuss the following question. Question says, the maximum value of x multiplied by x minus 1 plus 1 whole raised to the power 1 upon 3 where x is greater than or equal to 0 and less than or equal to 1 is 1 upon 3 raised to the power 1 upon 3 1 upon 2 1 0 we have to choose the correct answer from A, B, C and D. First of all, let us understand that for finding absolute maximum or absolute minimum values of a function f in a closed interval i, first of all, we will find all critical points of function f in the interval. Now, we will find value of function f at all critical points and at end points of the interval. Now identify the maximum and minimum values of function f out of the values calculated in step 2. The maximum value will be the absolute maximum value of function f and minimum value will be the absolute minimum value of function f. So third step to follow is identify maximum and minimum value of function f. This is the key idea to solve the given question. Now let us start with the solution. Let function f is given by fx is equal to x multiplied by x minus 1 plus 1 whole raised to the power 1 upon 3 where x is greater than or equal to 0 and less than or equal to 1. Now differentiating both sides with respect to x, we get f dash x is equal to 1 upon 3 multiplied by x multiplied by x minus 1 plus 1 whole raised to the power minus 2 upon 3 multiplied by derivative of x square minus x plus 1. Here we have applied the chain rule to find the derivative of this term. Now, this is further equal to 1 upon 3 multiplied by x multiplied by x minus 1 plus 1 whole raised to the power minus 2 upon 3 multiplied by 2x minus 1. Now, f dash x can be written as 2x minus 1 upon 3 multiplied by x multiplied by x minus 1 plus 1 whole raised to the power 2 upon 3. Here we have used the rule that x raised to the power minus m is equal to 1 upon x raised to the power m. Here this power was minus 2 upon 3. After taking the reciprocal it is 2 upon 3. Now we will find all the points at which f dash x is equal to 0. That is, we will find all the critical points of function f. In the given interval, now f dash x is equal to 0 implies 2x minus 1 upon 3 multiplied by x multiplied by x minus 1 plus 1 whole raised to the power 2 upon 3 is equal to 0. Now multiplying both sides by the term given in the denominator, we get 2x minus 1 is equal to 0. Now adding 1 on both sides, we get 2x is equal to 1. 
uh, this implies x is equal to 1 upon 2 dividing both sides by 2 we get x is equal to 1 upon 2 here we have completed first step of the key idea now we know x is greater than equal to 0 and less than equal to 1 so now we will find the value of function f at x is equal to 0 at x is equal to 1 and x is equal to 1 upon 2 let us now find out f 1 upon 2 this is equal to 1 upon 2 multiplied by 1 upon 2 minus 1 plus 1 whole raised to the power 1 upon 3 now this is equal to 1 upon 2 multiplied by minus 1 upon 2 plus 1 we know 1 upon 2 minus 1 is equal to minus 1 upon 2 whole raised to the power 1 upon 3 now this is equal to minus 1 upon 4 plus 1 whole raised to the power 1 upon 3 this further implies f1 upon 2 is equal to minus 1 plus 4 upon 4 whole raised to the power 1 upon 3 or we can say f1 upon 2 is equal to 3 upon 4 whole raised to the power 1 upon 3 let us now find out value of function f at x is equal to 0 now f0 is equal to 0 multiplied by 0 minus 1 plus 1 whole raised to the power 1 upon 3 this is equal to minus 1 plus 1 whole raised to the power 1 upon 3 simplifying we get f0 is equal to 0 now let us find out value of f1 f1 is equal to 1 multiplied by 1 minus 1 plus 1 whole raised to the power 1 upon 3 now this is equal to 1 raised to the power 1 upon 3 we know 1 minus 1 is equal to 0 and 0 multiplied by 1 is equal to 0 so we get 0 plus 1 is equal to 1 so we get 1 raised to the power 1 upon 3 we know 1 raised to any power is equal to 1 only so we get f1 is equal to 1 now clearly we can see out of all the three values of function f maximum value of function f is 1 which occurs at x is equal to 1 so this completes all the three steps of the key idea so our required answer is c so c is our final answer this completes the session hope you understood the session take care and keep smiling